Hi, I have a new FS121 here, uh, right out of the box, and I'm doing to do some initial settings on it. Uh, but before, uh, let's talk about the mounting. So FS121 is a remote flow monitoring unit. You can connect it with the flow probe via cables, and uh, you can either use a torque mounting bracket, which is provided like this and mount it onto a wall or pipe, or there is also a possibility that you can use the simple G thread, uh, which is provided here to uh, mount the FS121. And uh, yeah, now let us do some initial setup and connect the flow sensor uh, to the FS121. So now I'm also going to connect the power So here the sensor is slowly heating up, uh, which is shown by the dots disappearing from left to right, uh, similar like in the FS101. So the sensor is now heat up and uh, you see a default value in maximum mode uh, on this display. So we have to connect the flow sensor uh, uh, according to probe groups that are uh, in the menu. And the default setting for these probe groups is uh, FP100 flow probe, uh, which is P1. You can change the flow probe according to the requirement that you have. And uh, there are, uh, for example, inline flow probes available and also flow probes for hygienic applications like the one here with the tri-clamp connection or there is also gas flow probe so which is here and I'm going to do a change and uh, connect it to the gas flow probe right now and uh, I will also show how you do the change settings. Yeah so now I'm going to connect the flow probe uh, which is mounted here, which is a gas flow probe or flow probe for airflow. So I've just uh, changed the flow probe now to uh, airflow probe, and you see the display is uh, showing a little bit, uh, you know, uh, differently, and uh, you have to change the settings to the right uh, flow probe variant uh, through the menu. And to do that, I first unlock. And go to the extended functions and select probe. As you see, P1 is for FP100 probes. And uh, now I'm going to change it to the probe connected here, which is a, a airflow probe, and that falls under the group of uh, P4. Keep set pressed, and change it to P4. Press enter. So here you see the probe is now uh, connected, and uh, the F FS121 is also. Uh, showing the default values which are meant for this P4 or group. And uh, by changing the flow rate, you can also see the values displayed on the sensor also changing. And it's also important to note that uh, we also have a possibility to change the uh, length of the cable and the default length and Extended functions is uh, under CLEN or uh, cable length option is two meters, and you can change it to the requirements uh, um, as per your application. And it's also possible to do the same initial settings also uh, via IO link on here. I'm showing it uh, on our test. Uh, you go to parameters, there is this option where you see now, right now it's connected to P4 for gas. And these options are also available, which is FP1 for FP100 and P2 
for liquid, P3 for high temperature, P4 for gas, and we have some inline uh, FCI models that we have uh, seen earlier. One is with uh, metal and there's also one with plastic available. It may also be possible that in future when we are going to add more groups uh, into this uh, if the requirement increases. Uh, so yeah, this is the option for available in task for uh, changing the probe. And also here you can give the uh, cable length and change it uh, as per your requirement. It can be done up to 30 meters uh, between the FS1 to 1 and the mounting position of the flow probe. So that was about the initial settings and uh, it is also important that you have to uh, set the flow probe or the FS1 to 1 according to the requirements or whether you want to be it in a max min or a quick teach mode. You have to do a teach after mounting the sensor and doing these initial settings. Uh, by default, uh, this is uh, in max min mode uh, as in the FS101 and uh, you have uh, also the possibility to watch the uh, initial settings video on how you do a max min teach or a quick teach on another video that we have already available on Turk TV. Yeah, that was the initial settings uh, that you have to do on the FS121. Uh, thanks for watching and yeah, hope you have a good time with the new product that we have here from Flow Sensors. Mm -hmm.